Hi, I'm Megan with Green Acres Nursery and Supply and today I am going to show you how to make a cactus garden using some of the materials here. Cactus gardens are great as gifts or just for your, for your table as decoration. Some of the supplies we'll be using are here. We have uh, the pottery, of course, lots of different sizes to choose from. Um, it's up to you what size you want to do. We have a larger one here, medium, and then a small. Uh, next, you'll want the cactus soil, um, and then you want to mix Sure Start in with that to give the plants their best chance at, uh, at doing well in the little pot up. Um, and then it's choosing the, the cactus that you're going to use. I like to do something that's a little taller and then sort of medium size and then smaller, um, but it's completely up to you. We have lots of different choices, lots of different kinds as you can see here. And lastly, you're going to use your top dressing, um, which is usually different colored rocks. Uh, you can use these smaller ones. We have some bigger ones here that you can add in. And uh, sometimes I like to use these little decorations that we have throughout the store just to add a little fun something to the pot up. You can like tuck it into the side there or wherever you'd like. So we got the soil in there. Now we're going to add in some Sure Start. Mix that in. Decide which part of the pot you want in the front. I'm going to start with this big guy. Try to get off some of the nursery soil. Usually isn't as good as, as the cactus succulent stuff we got. Got to be careful of the prickles, but if you handle it gently, it should be good. Okay. Next, I think we'll do this guy. You don't have to remove a lot of the dirt if you don't want to. Um, this is something I only do with cactus and succulents. This is a really beautiful butter butterfly agave. These have been coming in so nice lately same family as cactus and it's a it's a type of succulent um, which is really important so that they have the same water needs which is not a lot of water this is a ripsalis it's a little bigger than what we need What's great about succulents is that you can just divide it up this way and then we will add a top dressing. So this one has a light green. So sometimes if I don't have the color that I want, I will combine ones in it and then I add this brown and to get a nice mixture there. have to use a top dressing if you don't want to. I think it just adds sort of a nice finishing touch. Makes it look cleaner. There we go. And then if you want, you can add something like this. Just tuck that in somewhere. And there you go. Now that you have your pot up done, Kara's incredibly easy. 
They like lots of sun, uh, especially the afternoon sun, and they don't need much water. Uh, make sure that they are completely dried out before you add any water. If you have any questions or want to make a pot up of your own, feel free to stop by any of our stores and ask one of our helpful associates.